are going to be changing the headlights and the headlight brackets. So, as you know in the last video, the oh my mind's gone blank. The bonnet got um, changed because the other one was bent. Part of what I found from that is from the crash, the lights and the headlight bracket arms underneath have actually smashed. So they're broken, which is why they sit so far back in the bumper. So I'm gonna go pick them up today and then get them installed today as well. So that there'll be brand new headlights which come forward. I'm gonna be getting angel eyes anyway. But the idea is that just to get these fixed because the headlight brackets I'm gonna need when I get the angel eyes. Um, so we're gonna do that today. Mm -hmm. I'll see you soon. All right guys, so now I'm gonna take the front bumper. Um, I'm gonna take the front bumper and take out the headlights. The reason being is because I need to get behind to see whether I can bring it forward a bit. Um, so to take off the front bumper, you've got six T25 screws at the top. Um, and then you've got a bunch of uh, bolts under the bottom in the arches. So I'll show you them when I get to them, but I'm gonna take off the top, remove the weather guard, take off the bottom um, wheel arches, and then, yeah, pretty simple. See, but let me shine some light on it. But under here, right, so you've got a bolt there, another bolt there, and another bolt up the top. I oh, don't know if you can see it, just up there. Just need to remove them. And you've got another bolt up there as well. So I'm going to remove them now. You have bolts going all the way along, so you just need to undo all of them and, and then on to the next wheel arch.
thousand years later. <laughs> Right, off, and I found out what the issue with, is with the realignment and why the lights were pushed backwards. As you can see, number one, the lights are completely smashed. Um, not only that, if you look in here, this light's smashed, but these bracket arms are actually broken. So it's the same on both sides. So like this light's cracked off of there the sides are sm uh, broken. So what the actual issue is, okay, so tomorrow, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go get two new headlights, two new bracket arms, and then tomorrow I'm gonna replace the lights, gonna replace the brackets, um, and then hopefully that should fix the problem. So we've got to do all this again tomorrow. Got to take the bumper off again tomorrow and everything like that, but hopefully that should fix the issue and then uh, everything will be relined back up. So. We'll continue this tomorrow. The next day. Right guys, um, welcome back to me in my slats. So I've picked up the headlights um, and the brackets for the car, so here they are. Oh, so these are the new ones. So these are the brackets underneath and these are the new headlights. I'm going to change these bulbs um, when I take these ones out, so I'm going to swap them around. They are, they do need a bit of a clean, but they are a lot better than the ones that I've already got in the car because um, they're not broken. So I'm going to take the bumper off exactly the same as yesterday. So I'm not going to show you it. I'm going to right take guys, so the bumper's off. Um, I'm going to show you now how to remove the headlight and the brackets. So I'm going to show you them both separately. Um, I'm going to show you how to do it and then I'm going to do it because um, I haven't got my tripod. So unfortunately I've got to stand my phone up on a chair with pillows, as you can see. Um, but with the headlights, so to take the headlights out, as you can see it, mine are broken, but you need to remove this bolt. But once you take this off, this black tab underneath does come off. You don't want to lose that because you need it to reattach the headlights. So you've got a bolt there, you've got a bolt here, and then the hardest one is, I don't know if you can see, but through this hole here, there is a bolt right down there. Um, so you can use a screwdriver to get down there or you can use a wrench and come from the side in there um, So they're difficult. I'm quite lucky that because I'm taking the bracket arms off I don't actually have to undo that. So because I'm taking these off all I need to do is undo this bolt undo this um, And then undo the two ones here because these take off the bracket um and it's all snapped around here which is what's causing it not to realign so to take off the headlight brackets is just two here um so they're the i'm going to take them two off and the one bolt up here because i'm taking this whole thing out together because i'm replacing
Guys, as you can see, light's done. Um, everything's working. Just need to take the other one out, change the other one, and put the bracket on and stuff and see, hopefully. So headlights are finally fitted. It took quite a while to do the fitment um, to get it all aligned up because yeah, it took a lot of work. Um, but I've managed to do it and they look a lot better. So, uh, so a lot better with the fitment. There's quite a gap here. Um, but to be fair, you can't really notice it that much. Um, so what I'm going to do is, it might actually be this corner of it, um, but I'm going to get angel eyes anyway, so it's not too much of an issue. Um, but they look a hell of a lot better than what it did before. Um, but yeah, so that's them. Thanks for watching guys. Obviously leave a like rating if you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe and turn the notifications on because I am gonna be releasing a lot more videos for this car. I've got a hell of a lot of stuff getting delivered over the next few days, which I'm gonna do on the car. So, so you don't miss out, make sure that you subscribe. Um, but yeah, I'll see you.